The road junctions on both sides of Ishuan Dam are slated to be expanded by 2026 to ease traffic jams in the area during the morning and evening peak hours. A Land Transport Authority LTA spokeswoman said the entry and exit points along the dam will be widened to accommodate a growing volume of traffic which is expected to increase further as more residents move into built-to-order BTO units in Nei Soon Link, Nei Soon East and Sambuang. Three traffic junctions will be expanded and reconfigured at Ishuan Avenue 1 and Ishuan Avenue 8. Ishuan Avenue 1 and Silta West Link and Silta West Link and West Cam Road. The plan is for vehicles heading to Silta North Link via Silta West Link to use West Cam Road instead. Naysun GRC MP Derek Go put up a post on Facebook about the improvement works in March. As vehicles will be discharged more quickly at the junctions, the traffic along the dam will flow faster. Especially during the peak hours, he said then. Mr Go told the Straits Times that he has received feedback from residents in the Nei Soon Ling ward about traffic congestion in the Ishuan Dam area since 2019, when he was still a grassroots volunteer. Residents reported heavy traffic along Ishuan Dam during peak hours from around 7 a.m. to 8.30 a.m. and 6 p.m. to 7.30 p.m., which would worsen when it rained. He said, in his Facebook post, Mr. Goo had said the improvements are an interim measure to ease the traffic congestion at Ishuan Dam, given that the original full improvement plans to be done in 2030 were way too far into the future. Asked about these plans, the LTA spokeswoman said improving the road junctions was the fastest way to address the traffic situation in the immediate term as it involves less extensive works that are mostly within existing road boundaries and hence do not require an environmental impact study. She noted that expanding the road along Ishuan Dam would require significant and costly structural strengthening of the dam and potentially impact biodiversity in the area as well as the Silta Fishing Village, located near the junction of Ishuan Avenue 1 and Silta West Link. As environmental studies would have to be carried out along with strengthening works, this option would not be in time to cater to the growing traffic volume, she added. The spokeswoman said the changes to the junctions will be permanent. With the upcoming North-South Corridor set to provide an alternative travel route for motorists when it opens in phases from 2027, there are no immediate plans to widen the existing road along Ishuan Dam or to build a new bridge across Lower Silta Reservoir. She added. The improvement works include building a park connector beside the road along Ishuan Dam. Mr Go said this will provide a dedicated cycling path for cyclists who currently use the road to travel across Ishuan Dam. Precautionary measures, such as the installation of silt screens and noise and environmental management controls, will be put in place while the works are being carried out, said the LTA spokeswoman. Motorists who spoke to ST welcomed the improvements, although some were doubtful about their effectiveness. Engineering manager Rod Gregorio, 45, said he is hopeful that expanding the road junctions will ease the congestion. As these areas tend to be choke points where traffic builds up. Transport Executive Karen Tay, 35, said the addition of lanes along Ishuan Avenue, it would be helpful, given the heavy traffic congestion in the area. Building manager Lokman Narakim, 42, is uncertain if the measures will be effective, given that the road along Ishuan Dam will not be widened. The bottleneck is at the main bridge, which is at the dam itself, so that is the problem area, he said. While Mr. Go said the improvement works are a welcome sight for Nei Soon Ling residents, he noted that further measures may be needed in the future. As traffic volume will continue to grow, with more residents moving into upcoming housing projects in the area.